Thank you, Tony. More on a more than a year, I should say, after the Boston Marathon bombings, another suspect has been arrested on accusations. He tried to obstruct the investigation. It was breaking news on Eyewitness News at noon. Federal prosecutors say the suspect lied to investigators and tried to delete information from his computer. Tonight, we're learning more from the indictment released today. Eyewitness News reporter Steve Nielsen is live in the studio now with the latest developments. Well, Mike, the suspect, 23-year-old Hyrulazan Matanov, appeared in a federal Boston federal courtroom just a short time ago. He did not enter a plea. Now, Matanov was arrested this morning at his home in Quincy. According to the federal indictment that was released today, Matanov was a friend of bombing suspect Tamerlan Zarnayev, and he also knows the surviving suspect, Shakar Zarnayev. Federal prosecutors say Matanov misled investigators about his relationship with the Zarnayev brothers and tried to delete evidence from his computer and cell phone once he realized that the FBI would want to question him. According to the indictment, Montanov allegedly contacted Tamerlan just 40 minutes after the bombings on April 15th, 2013, and invited him to dinner. Prosecutors say Montanov and both Zarnayev brothers met for dinner that night, and when Montanov later learned the brothers were suspects, he tried to downplay his relationship with them. Prosecutors say Montanov later tried to delete files off of his computer and cell phone. That includes, quote, some files that contained violent content or calls to violence. Montanov is not charged with the bombings themselves. His attorney calls the allegations unsubstantiated and says his client did not mean to mislead the FBI. I'm Steve Nielsen, Eyewitness News.